Welcome to Quest UAV TV. Uh, I'm Nigel and this is Rory. <laughs> um, what we're doing just now is a, a typical kind of impact test. Um, we do quite a few of these and we're just looking at the general structure and strength of our components. So what we've got here is, is, a, is a kind of prototype um, agri uh, body here and we are testing the our new gimbal. So what we've got here, um, Rory shows me, we've got our kind of dummy cameras which can take quite a bit of punishment without having to damage nice new things and here is our uh, new ABS gimbal. So Rory, yeah, put one in there, I'll get the other one in, get them around the right way, yep. Standard twin end DVI setup. Gonna pop into the uh, into the body now, and if my trusty and good looking companion here will ascend the ladder, that will be me to fame. Off we go. Thank you. So this is about um, a three meter test. Gives a good old shock loading. On the whole of the system, and um, we'll just see how it goes. Okay, one, two, three. Right, let's open up and see what's works and what hasn't worked. So, there we go. There is the gimbal. Let's pull it out and see. Now what we're after here is we do expect parts to separate. That's the way the energy is dissipated. So we'll see that the inner plate has separated from the outer plate, but that is not a problem. That is the way the energy gets expended and dissipated. So we have two cameras still working fine and we simply pull that plate back into place and then that will be ready for the next flight. There we go. That's it back in place now all ready to rock and roll to do another flight. So there we go. A very quick simple impact test. Everything's working fine and we're well happy. Bye from Quest UAV TV, from Nigel and from... From Rory, goodbye. Okay, right.